You said a few years ago that the stability of the euro will suffer if some of the countries who just joined uh, didn't respect the rules. Don't you think that countries such as Greece shouldn't have joined the euro in the first place? I think really that uh, at the beginning uh, the entry criteria should have been examined a little bit stronger. But this was, uh, has to be, uh, should have been done uh, especially by the Commission. But whatever, that is a long time ago. Um, with the, today, uh, one of the newspapers in Germany said that the Greece default is inevitable. Do you believe that Greece can get out without restructuring? I think that Greece has a chance for doing so. Uh, they have to address their problems in an appropriate way, but there is a chance for uh, coming out with a better performance. What would be the impact if we see a Greece default? What will be the impact on the European I banks? I don't see a likelihood of a Greece default, but let's see. Uh, it is in, uh, depends very much uh, what the Greek policy will do in reality. Mm -hmm. Is there any, if any chance that this happen, are we going to see a Lehman Brothers crisis in Europe? Uh, I don't see such a uh, Lehman crisis uh, situation in Europe. But of course, uh, Europe has to address the special challenges which is, uh, which, uh, with which it is now faced. Uh, and that means especially the countries which are in difficulties have to address their problems and to, uh, they have to come back to be uh, competitive uh, in the whole area, uh, in the whole Euro area and worldwide. Is the ECB right to rise the interest rate uh, before the US Federal Reserve, which is pushing up the Euro and hurting companies, European companies? I think the, the European Central Bank uh, did the right decision but uh, I'm not commenting in detail the decisions. If, if the interest rates go up, um, do you see any, uh, the periphery, the uh, southern countries be hurt by this policy? I think they are now faced with the consequences of the development over the last 10 years. And now, of course, uh, the markets probably are overdoing some think uh, to some extent it uh, which uh, they should have done already earlier uh, and I hope that the markets will look uh, into the longer term future and that the interest rates will reflect that in an appropriate way. Mm. You said for example what is the future for countries like, like Spain? I have not to comment the future of the countries I think they have the potential uh, for being a competitive uh, economy and uh, for being in the euro uh, and staying in the euro, of course, because uh, membership of Europe is not uh, a limited one. It is forever, but it has to be based on a competitive situation. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the government has done the right thing. To just kind of improve the I'm situation. not commenting the political okay. decisions. Marius Draghis, as the next ECB president. I will not comment on the candidates. Okay. Uh, I know him very well, I like him. He is a qualified candidate, but I have nothing to say to the other candidates, and uh, so it is uh, not my decision mm. uh, and not my job to make a comment to them. Okay.